The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. Hi, this is Mia Mohsen Zia, also known as Mia No Time for Love. Check out my latest book, Missing, available in print and ebook format on Amazon. It's now time for the Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, YouTube, iTunes, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and the MikeWagnerShow.com. Mike brings you great guests and interesting people from all across the globe. So sit back, relax, and enjoy another great episode of the Mike Wagner Show. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Widener Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. It's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Widener Show, get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, time to give official h- shout out to our official sponsor of the Mike Widener Show, international warring author Mia Molson Zia. If you love fast paced mysteries, you'll love Missing by Mia Molson Zia, available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. Missing is fast paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. It takes place in four countries, two strangers, one target, where truth is an illusion and those you love will be the first go missing. It's available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. Missing by Mia Molson Z has garnered great reviews and Eve 11 endorsed by Howard celebrities, including Joanna Cassie, Forge Riley, and many others. So grab your copy today for Goes Missing by Mia Molson Z, available on Amazon. Also, check out the Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com on over 30 podcast platforms, including Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also, Anchor FM, iTunes, Google Play, Amazon, Audible, Apple Music, and more. Take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. And for great gift ideas, go to Amazon.com and check out the Mike Widener Show podcast for cool merchandise like T-shirts, pop sockets, hoodies, throw pillows, tote bags, and more. Amazon.com. Check out the Mike Widener Show podcast. And for more great gift ideas, go to Amazon.com slash Mia Molson Zia for great books like Missing, Once, and Wrinkles. Also, T-shirts, pop sockets, and uh, hoodies, as well as phone cases and more. Amazon.com slash Mia Molson Zia. Check it out today. Also support the Mike Widener Show on Anchor FM, PayPal, and the Mike Widener Show.com. Make sure you give generously today. We're here with a terrific lady who was born and raised in the Philippines and began performing at a very young age. She completed her bachelor's at 22 and later performed in Asia throughout Japan, Hong Kong, Singapore, Indonesia, and Guam. She's been featured in numerous radio, TV, newspapers, and more. And she was also a 2020 LDM Music Awards nominee. And she's also got some great releases like I Want to Feel Your Body, The Love You Give, Missing You, My Favorite Things, and Here's Where We Meet. And we'll be playing Playing the um the newest from um Heidi Ten as well too, which is good vibes. And uh, speaking of good vibes, she's giving us right here live, ladies and gentlemen, from the Plus Studio somewhere along the uh, West Coast. The amazing singer songwriter and very multi talented Heidi Tan. Heidi, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Thanks for joining us today. Good morning from uh, Southern California, <laughs> and good afternoon in in East Coast. So, yeah, hi to everyone. It's nice to meet you, Mike Wagner. You're very popular, I heard, and um, you're very awesome. <laughs> well, well, thank you. You're pretty awesome yourself as well, too. The fact that, um, I mean, you've won like a number of awards as well, too. We'll talk about some of that. Uh, you were born and raised in the Philippines and began performing um at a very young age, you completed your bachelor's at the age of 22 and later performed in Asia throughout Japan, Hong Kong, Singapore, Indonesia, and Guam. You've been featured in numerous radio, TV, newspapers, and more, getting a lot of uh, great press. And uh, you also um, have some uh, excellent releases like My Favorite Things, Missing You, Here's Where We Meet, I Want to Feel Your Body, The Love You Give. And we'll be playing your latest uh, good vibes in just a minute, and you're getting some good vibes as well. And uh, before getting to all that, Heidi, tell us how you first got started. Well, I actually started music when I was uh, way back when I was five years old because I was uh, I grew up in my grandma's place and and my aunts were playing piano and I just find myself trying to uh, play piano and hum to the music that they play. But since then, I was also also like I've always been um, inclined to jazz music, and that's how I started. Like the influences from my family. 
And then um, when I was in 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 my uni- in the in the university in college, I joined the band and. I didn't think that it, I was serious about it. I have glee clubs that I joined when I was in high school. And I just find myself, we were just playing five to six nights um, a week. And that's how I knew that I think this is going to be what I'm go- going to do. And uh, and after um, a year uh, and a half with the band, I had an offer to go to Tokyo. So I wow. traveled at the age of 22. And I never looked back. Mm. And I've been traveling Singapore, Hong Kong, Malaysia. Indonesia, Guam, uh, Singapore, all, um, and then go back and then sing again. And yeah, that was, that's what happened. It's just destiny. I didn't even actually think that, you know, I had to audition because it just keep, kept going then. Wow. That yeah, is amazing. amazing. I mean, you, you've been like a sensation going all these countries in such a short time. And of course, you got um, a few of your singles as well, too, which just simply made amazing news. And um, what was that one precise moment that simply influenced you into what you're doing for the rest of your career? Um, Probably because I'm very passionate about music and I've always listened to jazz, but I know in my spirit that I've always loved music, but I did, just didn't know that I would turn it into a profession. and But I knew in my heart that that's what I wanted to do, that I wanted to do music, even at an early young age. Mm-hmm. And uh, you talked about jazz a lot as well, too. And who are some of your favorite artists, singers, songwriters, musicians, especially in the jazz genre growing up? It can go back at Sarvon and Ella Fitzgerald. Because my mom is also a singer. She said she was singing. So she has a lot of vinyl records that she plays. And I kind of listen to Sarah Vaughan, Nancy Wilson, mm. Frank Sinatra, Natalie Cole, Sergio Mendes, Barbara Streisand. So all kinds of artists that's just uh, doing jazz. And, and lately I was doing listening to Patty Austin and Anita Baker too as well. Wow. That's a blast yeah. from the past. Patty Austin and Anita <laughs> Baker. Those were my two favorites back in the day. Oh, my goodness. I have to pull those out and oh, play yeah. them again. Oh, my goodness. And, of course, since yeah. we're on the subject of jazz as well, too, that um, what are your thoughts on uh, the Miles Davis classic, Bitches Brew? What is that? Miles Miles Davis, Bitches Brew. He's one of the best oh, uh, yeah, yeah. jazz artists of all time. And Bitches Brew is considered the, uh, the standard of all uh, jazz albums. Oh, yeah. Of course, they're pretty awesome. Yeah, I, I love them. I also like Duke Ellington, actually, way back. So we had a, a record for Duke Ellington. So there's just a lot of jazz everywhere. I mean, in the Philippines, we, we love jazz because I grew up in the Philippines. I was born in the Philippines, and, and Filipino loves jazz so much. Wow, that's a rather interesting. And I always thought you guys were known for pop music and everything else. And um, you guys really mm-hmm. take in American jazz as well, too. That's amazing. And I'm going to throw another name out there. Dave Brubeck, <laughs> the classic Take 5. Your thoughts? Oh, I love that, my God. Uh, I always sing that. And and even my band, my quartet band when I was in Singapore, that's actually our uh, intro song is Take 5. <laughs> Oh, my goodness. I mean, all that's... All the time. All the time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's, that is so ringing in my head. So amazing. And we'll talk yeah. about some of your um, accolades as well, too, and also some of your songs. And we'll be playing good vibes in just one minute. But first, listen to The Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com, powered by SoundWeb Studios. Visit online at soundwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention to Mike Widener's show, get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, time to give an official shout out to our official sponsor of The Mike Widener Show, International warring author Mia Molson Zia. If you love fast-paced mysteries, you'll love Missing by Mia Molson Zia. Available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. Missing is fast-paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. Takes place in four countries. Two strangers, one target. Where truth is an illusion and those you love will be the first to go missing. It's available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. Missing by Mia Molson Zia has garnered great reviews and Ian Eleven endorsed by Howard celebrities, including Joanna Cassie, Ford Riley, and many others. So grab your copy today for Goes Missing by Mia Molson Zia, available on Amazon. Also, check out the Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com and over 30 podcast platforms. 
Take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. And for great gift ideas, go to Amazon.com and check out the Mike Widener Show podcast. And for more great gift ideas, go to Amazon.com slash me and Molson Zia. And check out the great merchandise and books as well. Amazon.com slash me and Molson Zia. Also, don't forget to support the Mike Widener Show on Anchor FM. Hey, pal, and the Mike Wagner Show.com. Make sure you give generously today. We're here with a terrific singer, songwriter, and amazing performer who was born and raised in the Philippines, began performing at a very young age. Heidi Tan here on the Mike Wagner Show. We talked about her amazing influences in jazz, pop, and um, everything else uh, growing up in the Philippines. And um, you also have some music out there, too. You got an album you got released called Here's Where We Meet. You also have some songs, I Want to Feel Your Body, The Love You Give. Missing You, My Favorite Things, and more. And uh, tell us more about the album and uh, tell us about more some of the songs. Well, the the first song that I actually uh, released was 2019. That was the album, The Here Is Where We Meet, where I met Rex Salas. Mm-hmm. And it's it, he, Rex Salas actually um, come start my career. Rex Salas has worked for Janet Jackson as uh, her musical director and he has actually um, worked for Luther Vandross, Patty Austin, has toured with so many artists. And I met him sometime in 2019. And he said, oh, I, lo- I love your tone. Let's do a-, a single. So that's when we did the Missing You. And then after Missing You was actually done, we kept going. Why don't we just release an EP? And it's just, it was just an honor. It's just, it's a Grammy and Emmy nominated uh music producer and songwriter so he jump-started my career and since then I just didn't look back it just kept going and I just started collaborating with other music producers um, all over the world and here in the United States and I'm collaborating with some Europe and South America and it just kept going it's just it's just a journey for me yeah, I'm just so blessed. And it sounds like you've had an amazing journey as well, too. And uh, we'll talk about some of the songs like Missing You, My Favorite Things, I Want to Feel Your Body, The Love You Give. And uh, tell us more about those songs and what inspired you to write them. Um, Missing You was actually co in with Gary Ford and Rex Salas. So those were actually, um, Gary Ford was a friend of Rex. And when they came out with the melody, because Rex sent me the track. And he said, what do you think, Heidi? What do you think should of the title for this song? And I thought about Missing You. And that's when we worked with the lyrics with about. And then Gary Ford came in, the best friend of uh, Rex. And, and after like a month, they came to a gig where I'm singing at. And then we had the lyrics and we had, we recorded it the same month on sometime January 2019. Mm-hmm. And, and then, yeah. And then after that, we just kept going and releasing more songs. Wow. I want to feel your body is a different. It's from Alan Bradley Litch and Pete Tokar that Alan sent me a song sometime 2020. Um, and I fell in love with the song. It was actually, um, produced by Pete Tokar. Um, Pete Tokar is a Grammy producer and Alan has actually, uh, produced for, uh, Gloria Loring. If you know Gloria Loring, the singer, the singer actress, right? Yes. Yeah. Friends and Lovers was actually composed by Alan. And oh, wow. it became like a hit then. So Alan um, sent me the song and I fell in love with the song and I recorded it. Uh, 2021, it was released and it was all in the US and, and UK soul charts. Yeah. Oh, so, my goodness. My favorite things was actually done by my friend in the Philippines, Bobby Gomez. Uh, well, it's always been my my favorite thing. It's one of the songs that I've always wanted to record. So we came up with our own spin for the song, and we released it to 2020. Uh, um, my favorite things, yeah. Oh my gosh, that's so amazing! And uh, what else inspire? Yeah. And what else um, inspires you to uh, to write the lyrics? And uh, where else does your inspiration comes from? Well, um, inspiration is for me. Writing is like the um, expressing yourself. Because when you write, you feel it. it it's going to come from your um, heart. When you feel like writing, you kind of... Because what happens with me is I listen to the melody and I came out with the inspiration. Some people write the lyrics first and then come out with uh, the melody. But it, for me, it's like hearing the, 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 the melody and I can come up with the lyrics. That's how we do songwriting. 
Okay. All right. Well, that's yeah. so- that sounds really good. And we'll talk about your latest good vibes. We'll be playing that in just one minute from Heidi Tam. You listen to the Mike Widener Show at the MikeWidenerShow.com, powered by SoundCloud Studios. Visit online at SoundCloudStudios.com for all your needs. Also brought to you by our official sponsor of the Mike Widener Show, international warring author Mia Molson Z of Missing, available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. We'll be back with amazing singer songwriter from the Philippines, Heidi Tan. After this time out. The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Call 1 800 303 3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention the Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next. Level. Hey everybody, my name is Forbes Riley and I'm an American actress and a TV host and I was delighted when I got my copy of Missing, which is Extraordinary Relation of Ordinary People based on a real life relationship. It's just, it's well written. It's amazing. You know, it talks about a man who has lost his wife and his daughter and it's very well done. I'm going to highly recommend that you go get your copy of Missing. It is a powerful, exciting read. Mr. Mian Moshe Zia. He is the author of Missing. And I want to give a big shout out and a kiss all the way halfway around the world to my dear friend. Check him out at Mia's website. It's called www.miamotionzea.com. Missing. Available on Amazon. Again, I'm Forbes Riley, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. Hey, hey, this is Ray Powers, and boy, are you in luck. Right place, right time. Tuned in to The Mike Wagner Show. You heard me. We're back with the amazing singer-songwriter Heidi Tan from the Philippines here on The Mike Wagner Show. She's also been featured on numerous uh, radio, TV, newspapers, and um, also a nominee. We'll have some breaking news later on. Right now, here's her latest song from Heidi Tan. Here's Good Vibes from Heidi Tan on The Mike Wagner Show. Oh, yeah.
right next to me. I just want to sing and say good vibes, good vibes. That's what it's all about. Great song. That was some good vibes with Heidi Tan. And tell us more about that great song and what inspired you to write it. Good vi- good vibes was actually, um, we came up with the track with Mike Harrison. Mike Harrison is DJ Blue and he's based in UK. So we came up with, uh, with the, the melody first. And first it was actually a slow tempo. And we just decided to make it like funkier. And then, and I told Mike that, um, that we, I wanted it to be um, titled Good Vibes because, you know, I'm thinking about what's happening to the world because it's just a lot of bad things and negative negative things that's been happening to the world. And I wanted to actually uh, release a song that inspires people and it's a positive um, song that, you know, that you connect with the people you love because you'll never know if you're going to be with them tomorrow or, you know, with what's happening. So it's just about good vibes and good connection with the people that's close to you, to your heart. And that's where, where we started working on the lyrics about good vibes. Oh, that's so amazing. And uh, where can yeah. we find good va- good vibes and all your music at, Heidi? Oh, so it's going to be, the good vibes is not released yet. It's going to be released on February 26th, next sa- Saturday. 226 2022 so it's not even released yet okay and what about the rest of your music where can we find all your music at they can find my music on all platforms <laughs> all platforms like youtube spotify pandora iheart uh, apple music amazon so and they can also subscribe to my uh, website which is www heidi tan h e i d i t a n n music.com and they can actually get updates and actually they can download the song directly from my website that could probably help us you know with the expenses because being an indie artist is not easy because you have to fund everything yourself right exactly yeah and we understand you're doing a great job of it we're here with a uh, singer songwriter Heidi Tan from the Philippines here on the Mike Wagner show you've been featured on numerous um, media as well too and you're also a 2020 LDM Music Awards nominee tell us about that a little bit of the parent and, uh, you know, before the interview, you had some breaking news for us. Yeah, actually, um, the LDM news, um, the I Want to Feel Your Body was actually nominated in LDM Radio this 2022. But the good vibes is exciting because it hasn't been released, but it's already nominated at the annual Atlas Elite Entertainment for 2022 for R&B and Soul. So I was like blown away. Why? Like what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's amazing. Congratulations. Yes. Yes. It is amazing. And yeah. And, yeah. and then I'm, I'm, I'm going to be the cover girl for Vanity Magazine for for uh, the year of, uh, for this February 2022. I'll be the cover girl for Vanity Magazine Asian Edition. Oh, wow. I'm certainly looking forward to it. Get your new copies now. Head over to the newsstands in Asia, guys. We're singer-songwriter yeah. Heidi Tan for the Philippines here on the Mike Wagner Show at Good Vibes and lots of other great music. And uh, we're looking forward to having you back on 2022 as well, too. And uh, what can we expect from you from this year and beyond, Heidi? Well, this year has been really... Uh, last year was a kind of slow. So, But last year was a blessing because I've been uh, recording um, songs. It has given me time to... Uh, to write and produce songs with my collaborations with Tony Garvis. Uh, the Love You Gave was actually one of the biggest hit last year that I that we released with Tony Garvis and Bruno Nessi. And Yeah, Your Flow Guard, that was actually all over the charts until now. So The Love You Gave was such a blessing to me too. I mean, I'm so blessed with, 
uh, being worked with these uh, producers and collaborations and songwriters. And this year is Mike Harrison with Good Vibes N. And 2022 is promising. I'm doing a show uh, next month, uh, March 17, at the Worldwide Jazz on, in Las Vegas. March 17, I'm, I'll be per- performing with other um, indie artists like uh, Willie Donat- Will Donato and Tony Saunders and many more. Oh, my gosh. That's so amazing. We're so looking forward to it, Heidi. And who do you consider yeah. biggest influence in your career? I think it's my mom because my mom has is the one playing all the music, right? Mm, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. And then my uncle, uh, Romy San Mateo. He was the one, he's a, he's a piano player. Um, he was famous then in the 80s, 70s. He was the one who mentored me. He was actually going in the, our house and teach, teach me how to sing standard songs, how to do phrasing, how to do the intonation timing. He was my biggest mentor, my uncle Romy San Mateo. That's so amazing. And what's the best yeah. advice you can give to anybody at this point? I think if there's any advice that I could give to indie artists that's just starting their career, you have to think that there is nothing impossible, that dreams can come true if you keep believing in yourself and you never give up. Give up. You have to work hard and stay focused and be humble. I think being humble will take you everywhere. So, And you share your blessings. I mean, if you can t- uh, help someone, um, uh, an artist, go ahead and help because you never know. You might, you know, the universe will love you for sharing your your for being kind and sharing your blessings. Mm-hmm. And so true as well. Once again, we're a singer, mm-hmm. songwriter, and the amazing, multi-talented Heidi Tan for the Philippines here on the Mike Wagner Show with Good Vibes and more. Heidi, a very big thank you for your time. You've been absolutely amazing. Looking forward to having you again soon. Make sure you keep us up to date. Keep in touch. We'd love to have you back. And once again, tell us about your upcoming projects. What's your website? How do people contact you? And where can people purchase or check out your music? Yes, uh, my music is available on all platforms, but they can subscribe to my website at www.heiditanmusic.com. And if you subscribe, then you can get all the updates of what's I'm, what I'm going to be, be doing this year, my tour, my schedules. And yeah, pretty much. And they can actually email me at heiditansongbird at gmail.com. So it's the same thing. So I'm 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 on. I'm actually on Instagram at Heidi Tan Music, Twitter. So actually, if you Google my name, you can just find me everywhere. <laughs> That's the joke. <laughs> <laughs> we, we certainly will do so. Once again, Heidi, a very big thank you for your time. Been totally amazing. Looking forward to having you again soon. Make sure you keep us up to date. Keep in touch. We'd love to have you back. We wish you all the best, and you've got a great future ahead of you. Thank you. God bless everyone. Mike, thank you so much for having me. The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention The Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios. Take your your image to the next level. Hey everybody, my name is Forbes Riley and I'm an American actress and a TV host and I was delighted when I got my copy of Missing, which is Extraordinary Relation of Ordinary People based on a real life relationship. It's just, it's well written. It's amazing. You know, it talks about a man who has lost his wife and his daughter and it's very well done. I'm going to highly recommend that you go get your copy of Missing. It is a powerful, exciting read. Mr. Mian Moshe Zia. He is the author of Missing, and I want to give a big shout out and a kiss all the way halfway around the world to my dear friend. Check him out at Mia's website. It's called www.miamotionzea.com. Missing, available on Amazon. Again, I'm Forbes Riley, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. Thanks for listening to The Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, iTunes, YouTube, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Please support our program with your donations at themikewagnershow.com. Join us again next time for another great episode of The Mike Wagner Show. 